But it's like this. A lot of people think the strategy to get better at Warzone and win more games is to camp and not fight people. They think the less they fight, the better chance they, they have at potentially winning. But it's a completely flawed logic because the less you fight, the more scared you are to fight, the less gun skill you have, movement you have, everything that you and your team has. Also, in-game, money, players, redeploys, UAVs, precisions, bada, I mean, the list goes on, bada bang, bada boom, but like, the, the list goes on, right? And they're not gonna get as many wins as they can because they're camping. The best way to get more wins, and honestly, it's not even just in gaming, it's anything in life. You gotta step out of your comfort zone to get better at anything, right? If you and your squad are so used to camping, I'm assuming y'all probably don't be winning that much, I'm gonna be honest because you're asking me for tips, right? If you and your team leaves your building and y'all start full sending, right? You're gonna, you're gonna be getting slammed for a little bit. But guess what? You're getting slammed camping and losing games because you're asking me how to improve anyway. You're gonna be getting slammed, but guess what? You're gonna be improving. You're gonna be improving. You're gonna learn how to fight teams. You're gonna learn how to team wipe teams. You're gonna learn how to not be scared in gunfights, right? So then as time goes on, you guys are going to become the best players in the lobby because before camping the first team you guys had to fight you probably got slammed and guess who you probably got slammed by the best team in the lobby because they had uavs they had precisions they had flares redeploys money bada bing bada boom you didn't because you were sitting in a building instead flip the script now you're that team now you're the team that's wiping people. Now you're the team that's got UAVs that can then rotate early. And even if you guys rotate early in camp, you guys know how to fight people now because you're not scared to fight. Instead, you going from hiding, being scared, to then you're the aggressor, you're gonna win more games because one plus one equals two. The more people you kill, the more wins you're gonna have. If you kill everybody in the lobby, you're gonna win the game. Yeah, you will definitely win more games. You'll get better. You'll have way more stuff because before y'all in the building, y'all had no money, y'all had no flares, y'all had nothing because you guys haven't moved the whole game and camped to try to win. Instead, you are now the aggressor. You have flares, redeploys, gulag tokens. Y'all got UAVs, precisions, immunities, armor, but everything, everything that y'all need because now you know how to fight. The more fights, the more wins you take, the more teams you wipe, the more wins you get in the game. Bada bing, bada boom. And also, your stats don't matter at all. I, I, I cannot preach that enough. Your stats do not matter one bit. I know a lot of bots that have high KDs because they don't, because they sit on a building and don't move. And the first actual fight they have to get in to a very sweaty person or somebody that's good, they get slammed because anybody can camp for stats and KD, but you're not gonna get better by doing that. Thank you for coming to my Warzone TED Talk.